Action News. Stole nothing. Read the box. Free donations. Explosive confrontation. The group of people caught on camera here diving into a donation bin, arguing it's their right. All new at six. What happened when we took this video to the nonprofit they targeted? Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Wendy Bryan. And I'm Jamison Euler. You probably think you're giving to a good cause when you drop your stuff off in donation bins, but instead some folks are making sure it never gets there. Yeah, that's right. And ABC Action News reporter Clifton French caught that group of people digging through those bins earlier this week and confronted them. And Cliff, he's live now at USF. But Cliff, this really isn't an easy thing to do, right? Yeah, I just want you to take a look. These bins are as secure, as secure as they can be without keeping people from donating. And while it's not clear how many times thieves get into them, one thing is for sure. Goodwill says if you're caught stealing, they'll press charges. Hi there. You're having me in town. Yeah, yeah, you know, I'm with ABC Action News. You know these are for donations, right? Yeah. Not for, not for taking your own stuff. Inside of this Jeep Liberty, four people try to explain why it's okay to take from a Goodwill donation box. This stuff. And These people homeless. donate this stuff and then they throw a price tag on it and, and they we... put it in the store. Only moments earlier, we witnessed the woman in the passenger seat standing on top of a grocery cart with her entire upper body inside of the bin. She climbed out when her friends yelled that I was walking up. She then covered their license plate and they drove off cursing. You know, you're a piece why are you wearing makeup, dog? Oh, yeah, because they're stealing. Jennifer Fleming is with Goodwill's corporate office. We showed her that video. She explains the items donated are used in their stores to fund certain programs. We have a work release program. We have uh, affordable housing. We have programs for people with disabilities. Last year alone, I think we served over almost 68,000 people. It makes me mad for someone to steal, period. <laughs> and folks donating here say they expect these items to go toward a good cause. It does anger you, it does, you know, upset you, but more than that, it's sad. That it's we, homeless people, right? We're homeless, we right? live on the street. Going back to those four people on Monday, they said they believe the donations are for people like themselves, broke and homeless. When asked how they were able to purchase the cigarettes they were smoking, they peeled out in their newer model Jeep Liberty with the tag still covered. And Goodwill has about 40 bin locations like this one across the Tampa Bay area, but they also have staffed drop off locations. Now, these are obviously here for convenience, but Goodwill says if you have the opportunity and the ability, take your items to a staff location. That way they won't get stolen. I'm reporting live in Tampa, Clifton French, ABC Action News.